Hey, I'm Brian Cohn of Bco Knives, and this is my review of the Broadbeck 2x72 Belt Grinder. Let's get going. The Broadback 2x72 belt grinder is a professional level belt grinder at an affordable price. That means that this is a perfect belt grinder for someone just getting into knife making, but is quality enough to still be used in a professional shop. So there are a few features that I really love about the Broadback. One of them is the fact that you start off with this really large 10 inch flat platen. That gives you plenty of space to grind your larger knives. For instance, I do a lot of chef knives and that 10 inch platen really gives you a lot of real estate to get those grinds just right. Another thing I really like about the Broadback 2x72 is it comes with a really large work table. If you've seen my earlier video, you know how much I love using my bevel jig. This amount of work area gives you plenty of room to put in a seven or eight inch chef knife and still have plenty of room to get all that work done. The last feature that I really like about this belt grinder is that with one knob, you can turn this whole thing 90 degrees on its side. Now, I don't really use this option very often, but I love the fact that I can. When you're looking at getting a professional belt grinder, there's a few different options. The first one is you source all the parts, maybe you'll buy the plans, and you build the thing yourself. For me, this wasn't the greatest option because I've never really welded before. But if you have that know-how, that is a great way to build a cheaper grinder at a professional level. The next option is where you buy a professional pre-built machine. This is by far the easiest because the machine will come completely put together and ready to grind. This is by far the most expensive option. The manufacturer will have the machine already built for you and ship it off to you, which again is going to cost more money, but if this is an option and you're able to spend that, then this is a great way to go. If you're looking for an option between the two and the best bang for your buck, get yourself a Broadback. The difference between this grinder and the other two options is it'll come in pieces like the first option, but you don't have to weld anything. It only took me about 45 minutes to bolt this thing together and I was ready to grind. Now that I've got you hooked on the Broadback, let's talk about your first major decision. So if you go over to their website, you've got a couple different options. The first option, which I went with, is the one and a half horsepower uh, fixed speed belt grinder. I went with the one and a half horsepower fixed speed motor because in my shop, I only have 110 volt outlets. This is a regular house outlet. If you have access to 220 in your shop, and have an extra $1,000 to spend, I would highly suggest you move up to the variable speed drive. Me personally, if I had 220, I would have gone for that option. If you go with the 110 option like I did, it is the exact same grinder minus the variable speed. You still get the large platen size, the large work table, and the fact that you can tilt the thing 90 degrees. All the adjustments on this machine are actually done with hand knobs. The toolless option makes for really quick changes when you're switching out your attachments. Speaking of attachments, something super unique with this grinder is the fact that you can just change out the attachment and you don't have to have a bunch of arms. For instance, one that I went with is a small wheel attachment. This comes with two wheel sizes and I use the thing all the time. A couple other examples of attachments you can find on the Broadback website is a replacement surface for your flat platen an integral bolster and fullering attachment, a slack belt attachment, and a surface grinder, which is really huge nowadays. Now that we've talked about the features, you must be wondering how much is it gonna cost you to get the grinder, attachments, and accessories you need to get started. The base grinder with a one and a half horsepower motor is 1450. Throw in a small wheel attachment, which I use all the time and highly recommend, and that's another 250 bucks. For $100, you can get enough belts to get started. Throw in a switch and a light, and that is more than enough grinder to get your small business started for $1,850. <music> Hey 
Picking up a 2x72 has absolutely upped my knife making abilities and has made me a better knife maker. And the Broadback was the right choice for me. Broadback is a small company run by two brothers who are constantly coming up with new attachments and new upgrades for your grinder. When I bought it in February 2020, I paid $1,250. Be on the lookout for coupon codes and discounts. Broadback Ironworks did not sponsor this video. I paid for this grinder out of my own pocket. My thoughts and opinions on this grinder are my own. So you know, when I say I recommend this grinder, I mean it. Got a question about the Broadback? Leave it in a comment down below. If you enjoyed or appreciated this video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you want to see more knife content, subscribe to this channel. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.